Hey guys, and welcome to Two Truths and a Lie, Thai pepper challenge sort of type thing. Cynthia, tell us what that means. So Jack and I are going to play Two Truths and a Lie, which if you don't know what that is, it's basically when you say two truths and a lie and the other person has to guess what the lie is. What the lie is. But the pepper addition we're doing is whoever loses has to eat a Thai pepper, which is right below, for scale, it's right below a... Um, Habanero pepper. Thank you. Yeah. Which is right below a ghost pepper, I believe. When that's the hottest pepper that was a pepper, it's still a pepper, but not the hottest. Anyway, <laughs> you've had your pepper history. Let's get into two truths in a line. We're gonna rock, paper, scissors, see who goes first. Oh, okay. Rock, paper, scissors, one, two, three, show. Okay, does that mean well, you, you get to pick? Do you wanna go first or second? I'll go first. <laughs> if I go first, does that mean like I'm saying my things? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Okay, lay it to me in no particular order. Give me your two truths and a lie. But specifically put your lie last. What? No! <laughs> First one. I have traveled longer than 48 hours before. Spent that much time in airports, basically. Spent more than 48 hours in an airport. Slash planes. Okay, I think I got enough slashes out of that one. <laughs> okay, and the next one is I fell off a ski lift. And the last one is, my brother and I have watched Battlestar Galactica straight for seven hours. Okay, right off the bat, now you're gonna think about it, I think your lie is you fell off the ski lift. No, I, I did fall off the ski lift. Well, what's the lie then? Wait, uh, it's, uh, Chris and I didn't watch it for seven straight hours, we watched it for eight straight hours. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> then that's true, Cynthia. No, we watched it for eight straight hours, not Yeah, seven. but you, it's seven's included in there, dude. You watch for seven straight hours and another hour straight, but like seven's within those eight. Oh yeah, I guess that is true. Okay, when you're <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't think about that, but I mean, <laughs> it is different. <laughs> I don't know what to do about you right now, but let's just go to my turn. <laughs> okay. I mean, technically, I still got it wrong because I thought that was a lie. But yeah, like, yeah. I was like, for sure, she's watched it for seven or eight straight hours. Yeah, but you still got it wrong. Because you said it was the ski lift one, that's true. You still get- I still get a point because- I got it wrong. Yeah, you got it wrong. Okay, that's how we'll handle it. 1-0. <laughs> anyway, let's get to my turn. Okay, in no particular order, the lie specifically lies. <laughs> wink, wink. Wink, wink, wink. <laughs> I auditioned for Jam Fest, a music competition in Austin, uh, with a guitar. When I left middle school to go back a grade, my entire grade got out of class and held a mini goodbye party for me, specifically. Mm -hmm. I love Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> All I can remember is that you didn't audition for anything. Your other band members did, or at least they did for one of the competitions you did. Like, you didn't audition at all. You joined the band after they had auditioned. I think that was Battle of the Bands, though. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> well, I know you hate the Chuck E. Cheese robots. They scare you. But what do I think about fear and scary things? You think it's cool? <laughs> I don't know anything about the mini goodbye party. I don't remember you telling that and telling me about that ever. What's what? Yeah. I don't know! <laughs> I don't remember you auditioning with a guitar. I know you auditioned for one of them, <laughs> but I don't know anything about it. I'm gonna say the Chuck E. Cheese one is what? It's true because you wanted to go to Chuck E. Cheese the other week. <laughs> <laughs> it's like another month. Really? The other year, technically. <laughs> I know nothing about the second one. I'm just gonna say that it's true. <laughs> because I have no idea. And I'm gonna say the first one's not true. Alright, you got it right. But not for the reasons that you think. Okay. I auditioned with the guitar. You did? Wait, that's true. <laughs> All my true? <laughs> Hold on, I need to rethink. We did the same thing! <laughs> We're both of ours! <laughs> we fail at this game! We're the worst! Ah, uh, we had the right intentions! But all of them were true <laughs> for both of our rounds! Did you mean to not say guitar? Yeah, but say drums! <laughs> Let's just say that round doesn't count. The entire round? The entire round doesn't count. Back to zero, zero. <laughs> Let's do round two now. Okay. But technically it's round one because the first one doesn't <laughs> count. <laughs> Alright, now we both need to check ours to make sure there's one lie in there. <laughs> okay, I got a lie in mine. 
Okay, I gotta lie in mine. Alright, good. Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll go first again. Sure, go ahead. The first movie I remember seeing in theaters is Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring. I went bungee jumping in New Zealand when I was 14, and I biked 30 miles in Death Valley. What's Death Valley? It's a desert. A dessert. It's a dessert. It's a delicious dessert. <laughs> well, I hate that you use specific numbers for your de desert, valley, whatever thing. Because 30 sounds like a big number, but I feel like you did that, but I feel like you did less. Your second one was what? <laughs> I know you've gone bungee jumping. I think you're a 14, but I hate that you use the specific number for an age because that sucks. But I don't know that that was in New Zealand. I have no idea where you bungee jumped. Now, number one, I'm sure that's probably right. But I don't know if Fellowship of the Ring is the one you saw. I Fellowship of the Ring is the first one. That's what I assume. I'm gonna go with Death Valley being the lie because I feel like 30 is too much and I feel like where are, where are you gonna bungee jump? I don't know where your bungee jumps <laughs> happen. I did bike 30 miles in Death Valley and I did bungee jump in New Zealand when I was 14. I did not, the first movie I remember seeing was Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. All right, my turn. I started straightening my hair after I got lice for the second time. I have fed a snake a live animal. It's a mouse. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you meant you fed a snake and then you were like describing what a snake is <laughs> and you were, called, you were saying it's a live animal. <laughs> and the first system I owned was an N64. You didn't own an N64. That wasn't your first system. You didn't own a PlayStation. Sorry, I'm not doing anything. I'm just <laughs> You're sending <I'm> signals. <laughs> <laughs> no idea about the straightening your hair thing. I know you started straightening in like eighth, seventh grade. 7th grade. But that's not part but of the question. But I know nothing about it when you got lines. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you fed a snake alive mouse. I remember you telling- no. I remember you telling me that you fed some pet in one of your classes. I think. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the N64 one, but if I'm wrong, that sucks. <laughs> that's generally <laughs> how it goes. Alright, well you're right. Yes! You never owned one, right? No, not until we bought one together. Aww. First in 64. <laughs> well, that means Cynthia wins, right? You got two points? No, no, we started over, but I have one point and you have zero. That's nice. So that means I have to eat the, what's the pepper called? Thai pepper. Mm -hmm. Yay! All right, I got about four Thai peppers here in this leftover Chinese food box. <laughs> <laughs> Smells good. Okay, should I go for the biggest one? Probably the one with the most seeds. To make this interesting, I'm gonna try to do as many tongue twisters as I can. But I'm gonna need you to remind me what they are, because I, I only remember like one. Okay. Now right, here we go. I love you. That's weird. And it's not supposed to hit you until you swallow it. It's hard to chew. Oh. They might not have cooked it enough. <laughs> hard to chew is hard to swallow. It's all in my mouth. Oh my god. Okay. <coughs> Whoa! Whoa! Wow! Okay. Um, what's that pick the pepper thing? Piper pick the Piper Piper pick the pepper. <laughs> pepper. <sighs> a box of biscuits, a box of mixed biscuits, a box. No, dang it. No, dude, she sells. She sells seashells by the seashore. She, <laughs> she sells. She. No. He sells. Who sells? Do you sell them? Oh, you're crying. <laughs> Drink your milk. No, I gotta get, if I get the two of them, I'm gonna get two points. Okay. <laughs> she sells seashells by the seashore. Nailed it. Oh, <laughs> a box of biscuits, a box of mixed biscuits, and a biscuit mixer, bro. Bam. Oh, God. <laughs> Drink your milk. Oh, God. It's so hot. <laughs> mm. My tongue's on fire. Uh. <laughs> Why do we do this? You're sweating a little bit. I'm not meaning to. <laughs> it's not on purpose. <laughs> it's still there, by the way. It's like on my tongue and the roof of my mouth. Remember, kids, if you're lactose intolerant, get almond milk. Or coconut milk. <laughs> Getting a brain freeze. It's not helping. <laughs> it's all on my tongue, man, because I couldn't so swallow it fast enough. Alright, let me do the sign off while I, well, I can't. <laughs> Thanks for watching this video. Oh man, how is it still hot? We love you, and we will to leave a suggestion for more videos mm -hmm. and more challenges and stuff. And uh, we want to do more hot pepper stuff. Do we? Yeah, we do. <laughs> we love you guys so much, and we'll see you in the next video. <laughs>
Thank you for watching. You did, give this video a like for me eating a pepper. And we'll see you later. Bye, guys. <sighs> Cut it. Cut everything.